What is up everybody, my name is Tyler Potts and welcome back to another video on the channel. This one is completely different to the videos we normally do on the channel. Normally it's more educational and we're talking about how you can do something. This time we're looking at what can be done and what I have done. This is a website I have built uh, recently for two rugby lads um, play for Coventry. They're pretty awesome. Um, and they've built this company called Nuts About Health. They sell CBD oils, CBD products, basically, and they are pretty, pretty awesome. Um, so this is a site I built for them. It's an absolutely beautiful visual site. I didn't design it. It wasn't designed by me. It was decide, designed by one of my uh, colleagues at work. And as you can see, loads of amazing uh, visual design, some amazing animations in there. Like just the subtle changes on that. It's just amazing. The little, just loads of different things. Um, and basically, I'm going to break down this website with you guys. We're going to talk about each component. And then you guys can tell me which features you like best in the comments. What you'd If you'd like to see more of this type of video. And if you'd like me to actually show you how you can create certain elements on the page. So... Without further ado, let's crack on. But before we continue, I wanted to talk about Affix Space. Basically, they've allowed me to um, do an affiliate program where you guys can get 15% off hosting. I use them myself. Um, it's pretty amazing stuff. So don't forget to go check those out on the screen. Now you'll see the discount code. You can use to get 15% off. They offer um, domains as well, SSL and all this down here. And just to let you know, it's only three ninety nine a month. So use the link in the description, go through, buy some hosting and basically keep yourself happy, you know, keep that website happy. OK, guys, so let's first talk about the uh, the first thing we notice when we land on the page. There's this amazing split here. So it's this white area with loads of content on this big image, this opening image with this little nice little pulse effect on the outer edge. And then this golden gradient going from left to right. You'll notice this site is very uh, gold and black with uh, white as well. And I think the colours really work with it. Um, you'll see we've got this simple um, nav bar here where it's just simple. You hover effect, shows you what pages you're hovering over. Um, a little phone thing is cool. So I used an after or no, a before um, pseudo element to basically create this black to follow up further for a pick. So this element actually own, matches the height of the rest of these. But basically I've added a pseudo element to make the black stretch to the top, which is pretty cool. Um, we've got the logo, CBD oil, salves, beverages, all these links. And then the search functionality, which actually works. So uh, I'll show you that obviously in a minute. So if we, you can see we've got this CTA button here, shop now, which takes you to the shop page. If you hover over it, obviously shows off a lot of shop. Just to let you know, this is built on WordPress, just for people who are wondering. Uh, WordPress is an amazing CMS and great blogging platform. Um, when you scroll down, obviously you've got this nice little banner with some stars, pretty cool. And then you've got these four items. I've used Flex to center, to keep these in their position. So this all this whole website is pretty much powered by Flex. And I think there's some grid somewhere. Actually, I think I took grid out for IE support. But, you know, grid, once they add that or just delete IE from, you know, their files, everybody do it now. Just drag it into your dip bin. You don't need it. Um, but yeah, one. Um, <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Other than that, flex is pretty much what I've used on this whole page. You'll see along these elements are all flex spaced. And again, another thing you'll notice is this really nice, it's subtle, but it, well, is it subtle? It's not really subtle. Um, this sort of animation where when I huff a transition, I'll call it, where the two outer elements, these two little like circles pulse outwards while the background has this gradient effect while the image in the middle just slowly scales upwards and it's such a nice little effect but it just brings so much emphasis to the product itself um so yeah that is pretty nice little feature there uh, if you scroll down we've got this little see our full range of products and then you'll see we've got these nice little tabs here. These just these are just obviously talking about the product, what you can learn about the products. Obviously, um, it's a again here hemp first marijuana. It's a it's quite a touchy subject, but a lot of people like to know. So this this section will show it talks all about everything on the page. And we've got this nice little um, 
slider here where you could slide left to right to see testimonials by other people. And there's obviously arrows and stuff. Um, I, so, I apologize if I keep sniffing or anything. I'm trying not to. It's because I've got a slight cold. Um, thank my kids for that. <laughs> anyway, so as you could scroll through, there's actually a slick, slick uh, carousel by uh, Ken Wee Wheeler. Yeah, this here. Look, it's amazing. It has so many features. I definitely recommend checking out. It's so good. Um, I use it for all my if if I need a carousel, this the this the only the only plugin I look to go straight for. So yeah, a lot of uh, nice little features in here, and then we've got this Instagram feed, which is really nice, um, which sits just above, like halfway above the um, the newsletter section where we've got this follow us little section, and it just sits just over this newsletter, and then. Got these nice big social media buttons here. Again, just aiming to get the people on their social medias here. And then you can sign up to their um, newsletter, which is pretty cool. And then you've got this fur, very basic fur, but just the job. So that's the uh, homepage. The homepage is pretty cool. And if we shrink this down, you'll see everything breaks down. It, it works pretty well on mobile got this nice little um, sliding out drawer here for the the thing and then you've got your basket as well you got your account icon and then your little search bar icon there um, everything breaks down basically we removed the images and just put text there just because it felt a, the images just took up too much space and this text worked fair uh, worked just as good You've then got this again, another hover effect. But obviously, on mobile, you don't really have a hover effect, so it's more like an active effect. So when you click something, um, you see this effect, but it's obviously then loading into the next page pretty quickly. Um, again, you've got this, which breaks down to two grid on mobile, which obviously looks a bit, a bit weird, but it works. It works definitely works on mobile. And then you've got the slider again. Text had to be a bit smaller here because fitting in out it was huge, but again, it's still readable text. It's I think it's actually 16, which is the um ex minimal minimum minimum accessibility font size. We then got the social media, which breaks down pretty nicely. Um annoying that it's only five and not six, else we could have had enough for image here, but again, still works. You got the keep up to date section with the email address and sign up button breaking down underneath each other to make more room. And then again, the footer again. No, not much like happening, but again, it's really nice. So let's, uh, let's go on to the shop page. So if we go to the CBD oil, so these are their oils. And again, we've got that same effect following the whole page to keep consistency. Um, which again just looks amazing and we've got this cool little thing here so this box this content box is basically going all the way to the left but only going up to 1366 pixels on the right um, in a content so there's 1366 here but we've done again the before effect and dragged the gray forwards again using position absolute and setting it over here so it gives this nice effect that it's carrying on even though it's in a container which I really like We've then done enough uh, um, keep up to date where you've got this nice little newsletter stuff and it just looks, looks really nice. So let's say we click onto a product, let's say this spray. Actually, so if you click that, you'll go through, but you can also search. And if you search a name and it's the only name matches only the name, you'll see that if it loads. There we go. <laughs> a bit slow there. Um, but as you see, when it loads, it loads up um, the actual spray because there's only one CBD oil spray on their shop. If there was multiple, then it would bring up an uh, archive page, as you'll see here. So there's this nice little feature image of the item. You've got your options here, so you can select your options, how many you want, and then add to basket. Again, big, bold typography to stand out. And then we've got this very basic slider here. Again, it's a slick slider and just just the job um, we've got this again a description and a specification here so different things ingredients shipping information and then we've got this cool little thing here so if we click right here this will take us to the next product 
but also if we go back down you'll see we can go back and forwards between these so we've got enough for cbd oil which is a 2000 milligram one which is slightly bigger obviously if we go on to here we can then see more of the product images um eat liquid and this just goes through all the products looping around which is pretty cool again there's the south there's only one product on this one but it's pretty cool again same same template for these three pages here so i won't go over those anymore let's go over to how it helps you because it's the next really cool page so you've got this really nice feature image here some more content on the left and if you scroll down we've got this nice little effect it's as you scroll and you hover over the sections this like nice little animation where the the image is slightly floating off comes into play and that's really nice i was saying i really enjoyed doing and then this i've really enjoyed this i think it's just a background image really works with that sort of scrolling um fixed position background some nice parallax in there too so this site literally has quite a lot of things um again buttons hover and that so if we click through to the faqs page enough of nice page it's using that content box again but this time we've got the faq so we can open each faq individually uh, originally i did have it so when you opened one and you opened enough of the previous one shut so you only had one open but some people would like having multiple open so kind of had to go with this sort of way here so we can open multiple and it's still nice you'll see there's this nice little svg animating turning around here um which again all nice little small features let's move on to the about us page so this about us page is again we keep getting this nice feature header i call this the fancy banner header because this took i had to rewrite this header how this header works multiple times because if you notice when you go down at certain le uh, non these are like not native screen sizes but so it slightly comes off center which isn't cool once you get to 1366 it's always on that point but when you come above 1366 which is the container size you then have to cater for just the specific sizes so this size is 1600 um anyway so yeah it was quite a hard challenge to build this header because it was a lot of elements um which but again really fun header to build so we've got the meet the team these are the two people behind it amazing people definitely worth uh giving them a shout on their instagram page it's a mate their instagram page all about like their health and their rugby and stuff so again nice little banner we've got this back in here just to keep up the testimonials it's actually enough a section here but we need content for it for it to actually display so this is a really nice breakdown of this website and by the way guys if you do want to check out this website it is live you can go and check it out at nutsabouthealth.net um, so we've got this okay get in touch this is a very basic contact page it's very simple basic messaging hit submit and it will send you send a, a little message out so um, we've then got the let's say these are content pages so we'll go for partners because there's enough of different ones so we've got this nice again the same header different imagery same sort of text on the left and we've got this nice little uh, section where you can see the um, the partners the people they partner with which is really cool nice way to feature your clients or your uh, partners or associates um, again if there's anything you see on this site that you would like to learn more about or how i built it or you guys just want a whole demo of a site like this i couldn't make the whole site because it does take a, a, quite a long time to build a site like this but if you want to see the front end anything like the to the animations to something else and let me know and i can do that for a video um finally we have this basket here um i feel like we need to add something to our basket really to make it worth clicking through to so let's go down to spray because it's the product that i always demo with let's go for the the lemon and we're going to click add to basket so that adds to basket adds this little dynamic um 373 which is the id and then the quantity and then you'll see we've got the item in here you can add multiple to this so we we could add a peppermint one too because you know who doesn't want a peppermint one then we've got two in there this only goes up to three this box here and then once you're past three um it just tells you that to check your basket to see more so let's click through to the basket page and as you can see here you've got your basket it's just a very simple basket page works really well just shows pricing quantities you can up it you can update basket and you can add coupon codes uh, which again it's a pretty awesome feature to websites now 
coupon codes. Everyone likes coupons. So all these little features, and then we've got the checkout and the continue shopping. If we go over to checkout, we've got all this information. Ask your returning customer, have you got a coupon? Again, all these little things, and then just the lit, nice little thing, and then the way you can pay. Uh, I'm not going to actually buy anything because you know I don't have the need for it. <laughs> but if you guys want to buy something, feel free. Um, and then you've got the login areas. I'm not going to log in because I. I haven't set up any details for myself. But um, again, yeah, you can log in, check out your account details. You can change your account details, modify all that stuff. Again, all really fun things to do, uh, especially when coding out this stuff. Again, a lot of help from WordPress itself. It's got a lot of the features built in, but a lot of things had to be built bespoke as well. Um, so yeah, so this is something I built and I really enjoyed building this. Um, Again, I hope you guys enjoyed this type of video. It was it was slightly different. I wanted to just explore a website and just talk to you about the website I've built. And now if you guys have any questions, any comments, anything you want to know about this build, then let me know in the comments below and I will get back to you. Um, and if you just want to see how I built some of the features, then let me know. Um, and we will we'll we'll do it. We'll do it for a video, guys. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out Affix Space with the link in the description. Use my discount code. It's T-Y-L-P-O-T-T-S or T-S. I'm not sure. It'll be on screen um, where I saw it or in the description anyway. Thanks for watching, everyone, and peace out. Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing Never give up, never slow, till I finally prove it Never listen to the no's, I just wanna keep moving Keep my head up when I act, head up, that's a fact Never looking back, I'ma keep myself on track Keep my head up, staying strong, always moving on Feel I don't belong, tell my thoughts to move along Push myself to be the